from hurricanes on the Gulf Coast to earthquakes in California, each part of the country faces different dangers. The common threat of terrorism is shared by communities around the United States. Officials from around the country come to the Center for Homeland Defense and Security to evaluate the threats in two different kinds of forums, an executive training course and a graduate program that leads to a master's degree. Participants work for public agencies around the United States. Deputy Los Angeles Fire Chief Mario Rueda says the work of his department has expanded. Uh, whether it be from hazardous materials, um, urban search and rescue uh, issues, a plane crash, transportation accidents, uh, sinkings of boats in the port, um, subways, high-rise buildings, uh, just a whole variety of, of events now that a firefighter has to be trained and prepared to respond to on a 24-hour basis, seven days a week, and the public expects proficiency when we get there. Florida and the Gulf Coast face annual hurricanes, but Scott McAllister of the Florida Department of Law Enforcement says residents must be ready for unforeseen disasters, both natural and man-made. McAllister says the events of September 11, 2001 are a prime example. Probably not a, a lot of folks uh, had envisioned the concept of uh, airliners being used to be flown into uh, buildings as a weapon. Um, the, the issue we face is, is really trying to uh, prepare for and anticipate that unknown threat. Ellen Gordon of the Center for Homeland Defense and Security notes that authority is decentralized in the United States, which she says makes coordination a challenge. Power is divided among the president and his administration, Congress and the courts, and further divided at the national, state, and local levels takes all three branch, all three levels of government, all branches of government at all three levels, as well as the private sector, to make it happen. So it's, it's, it is a challenge, but I've seen it work. She says addressing today's threats takes the kind of discussion and planning that happens here. Mike O'Sullivan, VOA News, Monterey, California.